Hello everyone, welcome to a new evolution video. Before we get into it, please make sure to subscribe, and don't forget to smash that like button, and leave a comment. I hope you enjoy the video. 1991, Final Fantasy Adventure. Published by Square on Game Boy, it is a Final Fantasy spin-off and the first game in the Mana series. The gameplay is similar to the original The Legend of Zelda for the NES. The story follows the hero and the young heroine as they attempt to stop the Dark Lord and his sorcerer assistant from destroying the Tree of Mana and dooming their world. Nineteen ninety-three, Secret of Mana. Published by Square for the Super NES, it is the sequel to the Final Fantasy adventure. It was the first title to be marketed as part of the Mana series rather than the Final Fantasy series. The game follows three heroes as they attempt to prevent an empire from conquering the world with the power of an ancient flying fortress. Nineteen ninety-five, Trials of Mana. Published by Square for the Super NES, it is a sequel to The Secret of Mana. The game follows three heroes as they attempt to claim the legendary Mana Sword and prevent the Benevidence from being unleashed and destroying the world. It features three lengthy main plotlines and six different possible main characters, each with their own storylines. 1999, Legend of Mana. Published by Square for the PlayStation. Like the previous games in the Mana series, it displays an angled top-down perspective, in which the player characters navigate the terrain and fight off hostile creatures. The game follows an unnamed hero as they restore the land of Fardil by creating the world around them and completing a number of interrelated quests in order to restore the Tree of Mana. 2003, Sword of Mana. Published by Square Enix and Nintendo for the Game Boy Advance. It is an enhanced remake of the first game in the series. The gameplay is an expanded and modified version, with elements added from later games in the series. The game follows an unnamed hero and heroine as they seek to defeat the Dark Lord and defend the Mana Tree from enemies who wish to misuse its power. 2006, Children of Mana. Published by Square Enix and Nintendo for the Nintendo DS handheld console, it is the sixth game of the Mana series, following the Sword of Mana, and the first entry in the World of Mana subseries. Children of Mana follows one of four young heroes as they combat an invasion of monsters and learn about the cataclysmic event that killed their families. 2006 Dawn of Mana. Published by Square Enix for PlayStation 2. It is the eighth game of the Mana series and the third entry in the World of Mana subseries following the release of Children of Mana and Friends of Mana. The story follows a young hero Keldrick, as he journeys to close a portal to a land of darkness that has been opened in the base of the Tree of Mana and is corrupting the world. 2007, Heroes of Mana. Published by Square Enix and Nintendo for the Nintendo DS. It is the ninth game of the Mana series and the fourth entry in the World of Mana subseries, following the release of Dawn of Mana three months prior. The story follows a young soldier Roger, as he journeys to defend several nations from the ruthless aggression of his own country in a series of battles. 2014, Rise of Mana. Published by Square Enix for mobile devices in 2014 and for PlayStation Vita in 2015 featuring a new narrative unconnected to other games in the series. The gameplay uses a similar action-based battle system to earlier Mana titles. The story focuses on two characters, an angel and a demon, who are cast down to the mortal world in the midst of a battle and are forced to share a body in order to survive. 2016, Adventures of Mana. Published by Square Enix for mobile devices and PlayStation Vita. It is a 3D remake of the first game in the Mana series Final Fantasy Adventure, containing the same content. The gameplay focuses on combat with monsters or other enemies, and is seen from a top-down perspective. The player takes the role of a young hero who along with a heroine, tries to stop the Dark Lord from destroying the Tree of Mana. Thanks to a power known as 2018, Secret of Mana. Published by Square Enix for the PS4, PlayStation Vita, and PC. 
This game is a 3D remake of the 1993 Super NES title of the same name. It still takes most of its gameplay from the Super NES original. Explored from top-down perspective, players navigate the overworld, dungeons and towns interacting with NPCs and fighting against enemies. Only the one who pulled it free can do that. 2020, Trials of Mana. Published by Square Enix for PC, Nintendo Switch and PS4. This game is a 3D remake of the 1995 Super NES title of the same name. The player controls three out of six characters, navigating field environments, fighting enemies in real-time combat. The story follows six possible protagonists in their respective quests, which lead him to obtain the Mana Sword and fight a world-ending threat. Twenty Twenty One Legend of Mana, originally released for PlayStation back in 1999, remastered in HD for PC, PS4, and Nintendo Switch. The story involves searching for the Mana Tree and is unique for not following a linear structure. During your travels, you'll acquire special artifacts that you can place wherever you'd like on the map to bring towns and dungeons to life and advance the story. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you liked it, be sure to subscribe for more. I'll see you in the next video. Thanks for watching, and have a good day.